Holidays are just around the corner. Unique cutting boards to display your favorite hors d'oeuvres and charcuterie boards for tasty cheese and crackers are all great things to have around this special time. Today, I have over 15 charcuterie and cutting boards to show you. They're all from the fantastic creators at Etsy. I'll leave a link in the description to each item that I display. If you're even just a little bit into woodworking or are willing to give it a try, these are some great ideas to start with. I have recently got into cutting boards myself and I'd love to show you guys how to make one. Be sure to vote for your favorite and once I get at least 50 votes, I'll show you how to recreate the winning piece. I really like number 14. It took a lot of time and skill to create it, so I encourage you to stick around to at least number 14 because I have over 15 of these really awesome ideas. What a great way to separate out your snacks. This platter board has slightly raised walls to keep all your tasty treats in the right spot. This cutting board is made with the end grain portion of several different types of wood, giving it a very different and unique appearance. The beautiful purple wood in this cutting board or charcuterie board is called Purple Heart and it's very rare and expensive. If I see some on any of the websites I frequent, I will leave a link for some in the description. These cutting boards were made by sandwiching several types of wood together using a lot of wood glue. You can purchase cutting board kits that come with a variety of wood pre-cut and pre-sanded ready to be glued together in any way you choose. I'll leave a link in the description for this kit in case you want to quickly and easily make yourself a custom cutting board or give one as a gift. This cutting board was made by starting with gluing several strips together, then cutting across the strips, turning them the opposite direction like a checkerboard, and continuing to glue and do this until you have the desired look. You can cut thick or thin strips off at a time and reposition as you like for re-gluing. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give a thumbs up to support the channel. In addition, I post videos about wigs, beauty, arts and crafts, home decor, furniture restoration, and much more. If any of these topics sound interesting to you, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the upcoming content. I'm working toward 10,000 subscribers, so my channel will have the ability to do fundraisers in addition to other cool features. I'd love your support. I hope you have a beautiful day, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.